Spencer Cassidine has a romantic surprise in store for Trina. General Hospital spoilers for September 11, 2023, reveal sweet first love, united families, big announcements, and so much more. You won't want to miss a moment of this romantic new episode. Trina, Tabiana Ali, has already told Jocelyn exactly how she feels about all the time that Spencer, Nicholas Alexander Chavez, has been spending with Esm, Avery Kristen Pohl, and she is finally ready to open up and explain her complicated feelings to Spencer. He needs to hear this so he truly understands what Trina has been going through. It all leads Spencer to do what he knows he should have done months ago when Spencer makes a romantic gesture to Trina. Will those two turtle doves from Uncle Cyrus, Jeff Kober, that Uncle Victor, Charles Shaughnessy, rescued finally come into play Spencer is not thinking about Uncle Sonny, Maurice Bernard, when he is with Trina, but apparently, the rest of Sonny's family is, as GA spoilers say that his loved ones rally around him. They know who he is and what he does for a living, but they refuse to believe he is an arms dealer. They all have to wait and see what happens at Sonny's arraignment and vow to be there by his side until this whole mess with the government is cleared up. They can't imagine Sonny behind bars forever, but what he is being accused of is serious, and he may not be able to beat this one. TJ, Taj Bello, and Molly, Brooke and Smith, have told Molly's close family members they found a surrogate and are proceeding with becoming parents the non-old-fashioned way. But now it looks like it's time to tell others. Giddy spoilers tease that TJ and Molly make a big announcement. Does the Ashford side of the family learn the news? Might it be too soon to even tell since they have no idea if the surrogate is pregnant yet? In case you missed it, mornings on Soapub are for commentary or wild speculation about General Hospital's current stories, where they're going, how they're doing, and sometimes just what we're hoping we will see in the near future in Port Charles. We're particularly fond of this one, so please click here to read it.